Hello everybody, Jet here, and um, well, welcome to my second video about this. This one isn't a short, don't worry. Uh, obviously we are talking about the Warhammer 2 trailer, sorry, Warhammer 3 trailer, which is on the screen now. I, I'm fairly sure most of you watching are probably as hyped as me. I don't know any more than most of you guys, if I'm honest, but let's go through this and see what we, what we can see. Obviously, from what we're seeing straight away, we are in the north, and Kislev is very, very much confirmed, which gives us access to whole new areas, so new laws of magic, such as ice, obviously all of Kislev's units, like bear magic and all the bits and pieces. Obviously, we've got Katarin here, who is the uh, current Tsarina, yeah, Tsarina of uh, Kislev, um, and Nurgle? I'm terrible at identifying, but we've got all four of the Chaos Gods being represented. Uh, being represented, and as we will see shortly, we get access to a huge... Well, the trailer has access to a huge, lovely Chaos roster. Now, something does... Um, again, I'm not the best person on law, and my uh, law person, Tom, is not available at the moment. It does seem very much like there's something going on between Kislev and them, some sort of deal which has been done before, which could be a lawful thing, but I don't know. And obviously, we have all the you will have access to all of the Kislev units, such as the Winged Hussars and the Bear Cavalry. Well, winged Hussars, they're not actually called Winged Hussars in game, but yeah. And obviously, we've got all we'll have access to all of those new Chaos units in the Warhammer 3 campaign. Um, we get a Bloodthirster shortly, which just looks truly awesome as well. But it's definitely a mixed roster of Chaos Demons and Chaos humans from the looks of it from what we've seen so far um but yeah it's it looks to be shaping up to be something really interesting from the trailer anyway um though i don't know if any of us are really surprised by the factions involved other than one uh, which is mentioned towards the end with kath grand cafe because i think grand cafe is going to be something absolutely awesome awesome uh because ca are going to build it up from the ground up obviously they've there is some stuff there but they have built all of that up you know they'll build all that up themselves as they did with the vampire 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 pirates faction which were in law but weren't really massively done so yeah and here we go we've got the bit you can see on the map here we can see grand cafe there and obviously that opens up a huge swathe of map where the um, ogres would be, for example, and chaos dwarves and all of those bits and pieces. So, yeah, I am seriously looking forward to it. Uh, I'm seriously, seriously looking forward to this. Uh, late 2021, it says on the uh, Steam page. Anyway, as we go into this, I'm going to watch through this time. The winter chill. No door can keep it from us And summer yet may bloom again Though eyes be all upon us My child There is so much to tell you That I have run out of time the sacrifice I made was not enough. The Dark Gods still feed on our transgressions. Corruption. Obsession. This Face these demons.
and again, I every time I watch it, I'm just getting myself more and more hyped, guys. Coming 2021, it is going to be so much fun when we do finally get access to that. Uh, let me know what you think down in the comments. Uh, let you know what what other factions you think we're going to get. You know, it opens up a whole world of possibility for DLCs with, like, Nippon and... Uh, Obviously, the ogres and chaos dwarves are going to have to be there at some point. But that area of the world, my understanding, has a whole load of different bits and pieces. So it's going to be good. Thank you very much for watching, guys. If you haven't already, please do like and subscribe. And if you can't wait to get your fill of Kislev, just remember I have a Kislev Reborn mod playthrough going at the moment, which will be up in around... Uh, my next video for will be up in around an hour, so check that out as well. Thank you very much, guys.